this week we're at Milestone Caravan site near Newark and next door there is now a micro pub and brewery so let's have a look around here and see what's about you just hit my YouTube channel there's a seating area at the front and there is also a food van which comes each night different one which is located in the car park and tonight's van is the fish and chip shop van Have you really? Wow. Moho. Moho, UK yeah. Moho. Yeah. Watch them all on YouTube. Hello. <laughs> So we're going to go sit out back in the beer garden. Abby is just checking for any beer that's left in Andy's beard, as she does. There are roof areas at each end of the beer garden and these have heaters in to keep you warm on the colder nights. Me and the camper van are actually the same age, but I do think the camper van's probably in better condition than what I am. And this is where all the magic takes place and the beer is made. Andy is testing out one of the ales, he tells me it's very good and I'm drinking the lager which is also excellent. So shall we go for a walk around the site and see what's there? The first stop you make is at reception to check in and you'll get a pop for the barrier. Pictures are allocated to you so you don't have to go looking for one. The telephone box is a book exchange and there are a few books in here that you can borrow or swap. There are two facilities blocks, this one's near reception and has the usual toilet, showers, laundry etc. And the dog wash is also located here too. The information hut has the leaflets for things that are on in the local area and places of interest to visit. We were allocated pitch 36, which is a grass pitch, as when we booked there were no hard standings available, so we went for a grass pitch. The lake is absolutely beautiful and it's lovely to have a walk around. You can go up and down and through the middle and it's worth spending a little time just sauntering around.
There are 103 pitches on the site and there are also some park homes. When you find the dog walk sign, if you walk through the gate, it takes you onto a lane, which is reasonably quiet, you don't really see very much up there, and it's nice for the dogs to have a walk. Abby does like to have a good sniff around here, I think she can probably smell all the other dogs that have walked up here before her. So I hope you've enjoyed this little tour of Milestone campsite and the brewery and shop next door. It's certainly worth a visit. If you have enjoyed watching this please don't forget to subscribe, leave us a comment and hit the notification bell so that you're notified of our future uploads and we'll see you on the next vlog. Thanks for watching, bye for now.